reaching the age of adolescence learning about hormones other than sex hormones Hormones other than sex hormones The hormones secreted by the pituitary stimulate testes and ovaries to produce their hormones You have already learned that the pituitary gland is an endocrine gland It is attached to the brain apart from the pituitary the testes and the ovaries there are other endocrine glands in the body such as thyroid pancreas and adrenals if a person's hormones are disturbed he may suffer from any of these ailments one of our neighbors had a very big and bulging throat he was suffering from goiter a disease of thyroid gland his thyroid gland was not producing the hormone thyroxin my uncle was suffering from diabetes because his pancreas was not producing the hormone insulin in sufficient quantities adrenal glands secrete hormones which maintain the correct salt balance in the blood adrenals also produce the hormone adrenaline it helps the body to adjust to stress when one is very angry embarrassed or worried thyroid and adrenals secrete their hormones when they receive orders from the pituitary through its hormones pituitary also secretes growth hormone which is necessary for the normal growth of a person role of hormones in completing the life history of an insect and frogs young ones to adults the new individuals which are born or hatched from the eggs continue to grow till they become adults in some animals the young ones may look very different from the adults frog is another such example observe the different stages of frog starting from the egg to the adult stage we find that there are three distinct stages that is egg tadpole larva adult Don't the tadpoles look so different from the adults? Can you imagine that these tadpoles would someday become frogs? Similarly, the caterpillars or the pupa of silkworm looks very different from the adult moth. The features that are present in the adult are not found in these young ones. Then what happens to the tadpoles or caterpillars thereafter? You must have seen a beautiful moth emerging out of the cocoon. In the case of tadpoles they transform into adults capable of jumping and swimming the transformation of the larva into an adult through drastic changes is called metamorphosis metamorphosis in insects is controlled by insect hormones in a frog it is controlled by thyroxin the hormone produced by thyroid thyroxin production requires the presence of iodine in water if the water in which the tadpoles are growing does not contain sufficient iodine the tadpoles cannot become adults reproductive health the physical and mental well-being of an individual is regarded as an individual's health to keep the body healthy every human being at any age needs to have a balanced diet The person must also observe personal hygiene and undertake adequate physical exercise. Nutritional needs of the adolescents. Adolescence is a stage of rapid growth and development. Hence, the diet of an adolescent has to be carefully planned. In the adolescent stage, one should have balanced diet. Balanced diet means that The meals include proteins, carbohydrates, fats, and vitamins in requisite proportions. Our Indian meal of roti, rice, dal, pulses, and vegetables is a balanced meal. Milk is balanced food in itself. Fruits also provide nourishment. For infants, 
Mother's milk provides all the nourishment that they need. Iron builds blood and iron rich foods such as leafy vegetables, jaggery, meat, citrus, Indian gooseberry, amla are good for adolescents. Personal hygiene. Everyone should have a bath at least once every day. It is more necessary for teenagers because the increased activity of sweat glands sometimes makes the body smelly. All parts of the body should be washed and cleaned every day. If cleanliness is not maintained, there are chances of catching bacterial infection. Girls should take special care of cleanliness during the time of menstrual flow. They should keep track of their menstrual cycle and be prepared for the onset of menstruation. Physical exercise Walking and playing in fresh air keeps the body fit and healthy. All young boys and girls should take walks, exercise and play outdoor games. Adolescent Pregnancy You might know that in our country the legal age for marriage is 18 years for the girls and 21 years for the boys. This is because Teenage mothers are not prepared mentally or physically for motherhood. Early marriage and motherhood cause health problems in the mother and the child. It also curtails employment opportunities for the young women and may cause mental agony as she is not ready for responsibilities of motherhood. Say no to drugs. Adolescence is a period of much activity in the body and mind which is normal part of the growing up. So, do not feel confused or insecure. If anybody suggests that you will get relief if you take some drugs, just say no unless prescribed by the doctor. Drugs are addictive. If you take them once, you will feel like taking them again and again. They harm the body in the long run. They ruin health and happiness. You must have heard about AIDS, which is caused by a dangerous virus, HIV. This virus can pass on to a normal person from an infected person by sharing the syringes used for injecting the drugs. It can also be transmitted to an infant from the infected mother through her milk. The virus can also be transmitted through sexual contact with the person infected with HIV. Summary Sex of the unborn child depends on whether the zygote has XX or XY chromosomes. It is important to eat balanced food and maintain personal hygiene during adolescence. That is all in this chapter students. Enjoy learning. Learning is fun 